So Larry had a question about, or, or he, had, he had a problem he wanted to try and solve, where his fly line is hitting his rod on his back cast and sometimes on his forward cast. And there's a couple things uh, that can cause that. If our fly line is hitting a rod tip on our back cast, what can sometimes happen is we're not getting smooth acceleration. We're lifting the rod tip up at one speed rather than accelerating, then trying to make that flick, and that line's kind of colliding into that rod. So here, then there, you can see that line just hit the rod. So when we make that back cast, just think we want to make that smooth acceleration, speed up and accelerate to that stop, then accelerate to that stop for the forward cast. What can also cause that line to hit that rod tip on that back cast is stopping that rod tip a little too soon, right there. If I don't come back far enough, when I make this back cast, that line is going to hit the rod tip and that's going to stop it. When we get that line hitting our fly rod on the back or on the forward cast, sometimes we could wait too long, that line starts to fall, then we try to make that forward cast and that line kind of piles into that rod there. That can also be caused by stopping that rod tip a little bit too soon on that forward cast. When that line hits that rod tip, that's usually a tailing loop from too short of a casting stroke right there or too short of a casting stroke on the back cast there. So just think, you know, we want to get roughly a 45 degree angle with say 25, 30 feet here to about here. I tell a lot of kids when I do lessons with them that think of it like a piece of cake. It's just a slice of cake or a piece of pie. Not too far back, not too far forward, but we don't want a real thin slice because then that line is just going to tangle up in the rod like a mess. So just think about a 45 degree angle, not too far back, not too far forward. There to there for your most common lengths of line when you're uh, you know, 30, 40 feet. Once you get longer, yeah, that slice of pie gets a little bit bigger. Not too far back, not too far forward. But just think, uh, if that line is hitting your rod on your back cast, smooth acceleration. Don't go at one speed, one speed, one speed, then flick. That's going to cause that mess. Start slow, but accelerate to that stop. And then accelerate to that stop on the forward cast. Don't wait too long. Start to creep forward and then try to make that forward cast. You can get those piles of line up in the air around your rod tip. I've actually seen rods break from uh, casting like that. So just think smooth acceleration, get that line to jump out, smooth acceleration, get it to jump out on that forward cast on the back and the forward. And that should help deal with that line hitting your rod.